Hey guys, just a quick tip video. All I'm doing right now is I'm just going to dip the tip a little bit in. I'm just going to dip the tip in, okay? I'm going to put a tip in, just swirl it around a little bit and pull it out again. There's going to be no deepness in this. I'm not going to go all the way deep. But what I got to tell you guys is that when you're trying to, you know, make results and you're trying to really push your body, whether you're trying to cut or you're trying to put muscle on, you know, and you're really going for it. And, you know, you really want to see big changes, you know? you got to quit with the feelings shit. We all know what feelings are, right? I'm happy. I'm sad. I'm angry. I'm horny. I don't want to do the horny thing. I don't want to get on the internet and be horny and sending orbiting pictures to ladies. That's not what I do, you know? I just get it out on cam. It's much easier. Let me Snapchat 10 seconds. They, then it's deleted. Just, they can't screenshot that. But anyway, I, I digress things. Basically, you know, a lot of the time when you're in the trenches and you're making the results, you're going to feel pretty shit. I'm going to be honest with you. There's going to be, you're going to feel shit more days than you feel good. And a lot of people are like, well, why, why would you do this? You know, why are you putting yourself through this? Were you feeling shit? You know, if you don't, you know, if you're feeling shit consist on a consistent basis, why would you want to do this? Because at the end of the day, like if you really want to do something, for yourself, not for anyone else. You really want to do this for yourself. You're going to have to be ready for sacrifice. You see, because it's very easy to do to go to the gym. It's very easy to eat your diet. It's very easy to stick to a plan and be consistent when things are easy. But when things are hard, when life is hard, then it's then it's difficult. You know, then when you when you wake up in the morning and you feel tired and you don't want to go to the gym, but you go. When you feeling like you fancy some cookies and some cream cake and but instead you've got a chicken tit chicken tit with a bit of broccoli and you have to eat that you know it's very difficult you know when you're feeling really skinny or you're feeling bloated or whatever you know and you don't want to go to the gym or you just feel like oh it's just a waste of time these are the things where the mind you know the mind is the most strong thing i'm telling you to make results on paper is very simple you just got to follow a consistent good eating plan you just got to be very intense in the gym you got to follow a good cardio plan and obviously get your supplements in. But really what will deliver the results is the mindset to go through that with all the challenges that come across. Because, you know, really your body doesn't like change. It doesn't want to change. It's going to fight you all the way. So sometimes, obviously, if you're being run over by a car and you cannot feel your legs, then you really should take that into consideration and take a rest day off the gym. Probably... Get seen to the hospital and get that get that looked at. But a lot of the times, you're going to have to disregard how you feel when you're trying to achieve a result. Because really, that disconnection and detachment of feelings and just functioning with tunnel vision is what's going to actually allow you to manifest the results you're seeking into actual real life. That is my, that is my, that, let me say my piece. I pull my tip out now. Three minutes of tip was in. Three minutes of tip was within there. I pulled the tip out. I hope I've left you soaked with knowledge.